What's good, everybody? It is your boy, Doc Flight K Clash K247. We are here back showing you guys some heat at a 3 4 bear against a bunch defense. Now, I'm been getting into the lab a little bit, learning a few heaters and learning some nice coverages in the back to learn how to play this game and to get ready for the competitive season coming up next year. And I sat here and found some heat at a 3 4 bear to go ahead and show you guys. And it's right here in Trio Sky Zone. You guys can see it right there. Um,. You can kind of have kind of have a cover three, kind of make it into like a cover two if you want to, uh, make it into like a cover four, cover six. You know what I'm saying? So you can do many different things with this, and make sure that you have the right people in there with the right abilities to even make this better. Like you guys know about uh, Julius Peppers with that uh, double or nothing as a safety. You can go ahead and use him in the spot where the uh, purple is here on the uh, play art. And you can actually do some damage here with this formation. So now we're going to go up here to pretty much one of the more popular players here in the game, which is clear out and show you guys how this is back here. We're going to go ahead and make uh, the running back go on a wheel route and then show you guys the adjustments here on defense on how to do this without a block running back to make them go ahead and block that running back. One less person you got to worry about to go use her uh, somewhere else. So here you're going to shift your D line to the left and then press move your safety down put him into a deep half and then your middle linebacker right here into a middle third now if you want to you can move him over like this if you want to and then go ahead and hover right here into the gap make sure you go ahead and blitz x over here on this side every single time i do not care if he goes out on a route or not you can even go ahead and man him up to the running back if you want if you feel like that's going to work um if you're not going to have him loop then I would suggest go ahead and manning him up to the running back so you can go ahead and use it anything else that you want. But here, make sure the point of attack of your defensive line is slanting inside. Make sure you do that 100% just so you can go ahead and have Cox come in completely free. And we're just going to go ahead and hike this ball. Make sure you go ahead and use your 60, and you guys can see he gets into the gap every single time. Now, Sometimes when this happens, he will go ahead and loop inside. Like, as you guys can see right here, that's literally a free gap right here towards the quarterback every single time. Doesn't matter how you put it. He's just going to come in free every single time. Now, either he's going to go ahead and take that route or he's going to loop inside. But that still means he's coming in completely free. Now, you guys are wondering, all I got to do is just block a running back. And that's going to go ahead and um, counter that. Yes. But here's another thing that you can do to kind of counter that. Now, as you guys can see, we have the same setup here once again. Here on offense, we're going to go ahead and block the running back this time. And what we're all we're going to do is shift the point of attack to the left. Okay? Point of attack goes over to the left. Um, what you kind of want to do is you do want to stay right here in that zone. Kind of occupy the left guard and not... Uh, Cox will get open now Micah Parsons will get open here on this side and you guys know Micah has uh, uh, What you call it? He has the abilities to you know, like double or nothing speed So, you know, he has those edge rushing abilities So now what you want to do is if you want to go ahead and blitz a uh, But you guys can see he goes inside of this little angle uh, this will be like where the Julius Peppers will go but Blitz him again so he can go inside of this uh, Blitzing angle move him out just a little bit and now he beeline straight to the quarterback on that side So all you're gonna need to do here as soon as it hikes just stay right here Occupy the left guard and he will come in free on that left side and Then the right side it will automatically come out just as fine. So here we'll hike it I'll stay right here and you guys can see now you got pressure coming in from both sides. Now, not it's not always going to be Micah on that side. Or it is Mike can be, uh, you know, number 97. It might be 11. But just know it's going to be one of them that comes in free every single time. As you go ahead and hike, as I'm guarding right here with uh, 60, you guys can see, look at this. Bro, it was 90 coming in as a defensive tackle, literally running through both. Like that's, that's just, that will piss somebody off so much. You already know, like you probably watching this, you probably feel disgusted. 
literally looping around. Everybody got hit up. Even Michael was going to get free, but then that just frees up Lawrence because number 70 was looking at Michael Parsons the whole time. He was not even realizing, like, Demarcus Lawrence is just going to come in completely free. To show that this is not a fluke, we are going to go ahead and set this up again. Boom, bring you in. Boom, boom. Make sure the point of attack is to the left. Go out here. Mo just move. Just yiggle him just a little bit. Yiggle him out as well. Uh, make sure you re-blitz them again. Like I said, re-blitz A, re-blitz X. So now they're in those angles. And now if you are blitzing them and want to do that, make sure you can go ahead and move him all the way over so you can go ahead and play that zone. Now you're going to play a soft squad over there. But once again, make sure you hover right there just so you can go ahead and get that glitchy little animation that you just seen. Boom. Hike it once again. Boom. So now you got double edge pressure coming in from both sides. Match defense playing very, very well. And just, you know, just coming straight for the quarterback doing what he does best. So now we're going to go into the instant replay one more time. And instead of DeMarcus Lawrence getting that loop in once again, he actually gets picked up. So now Cox comes in completely free. And you have the corner on the right side coming in completely free. So now when you have this coming towards your quarterback, you can kind of get a little freaky in the back with the zone abilities. I mean, yeah, with the zones in the back and play with different coverages. We're going to go ahead and set that up one more time. And I can go ahead and show you guys real quick different things that you can do here in the back. Uh, boom, boom. You can bring him all the way down. Put him in that mid third once again. And you can kind of do this right here because since you're blitzing him, you can kind of go ahead and do a look like this. You can do boom, boom. Kind of have like a little shell over there on that side here. Boom. And then if you want to, you can kind of do this. If you want to, this. You just many different things you can do with this formation and like really make it your own. Boom. You can even do that if you want to. It's cover three. Uh, then kind of have like the little shell over here on this side if you really want to. It's different things that you can do. Or if you really want to, if you know that he's going to come out here in that, uh, what you call it? In that corner route, you can do this as well. Boom. Now I'm going to show you guys the uh, blitz one more time. And you have it on the edges and you have that out there. So really the only thing that you might have to worry about is going back towards getting that, uh, what you call it? getting the uh you know number 17 or 84 as your user but as i said right here boom somebody's going to come in free every single time you guys see it's all still a box no matter how the adjustments are with that match it's still going to be a box once again boom coming out there everybody did get that little bump right there i kind of bumped them a little bit which was my fault but you guys can still see that somebody's still coming in free it's not going to be that easy of a pass um you could, you could have got one over there on that side, but just like I said, you have uh, Trayvon going back playing that route. You have Kelvin Joseph over there back in the corner route, user and all that. You have everything literally backed up. So hopefully you guys did enjoy that. Make sure you guys go ahead and try this out. Incorporate it into your own scheme. Use the man version if you would like to. Go ahead and play around with that to see if the man works for you. The zone sitting here works for you. And let me know down in the comments how you guys like this. Leave a like, show you guys more heat just like this. Subscribe if you guys are new. And as always, folks, peace out.